welcome everybody, everything, everyone. And yes, we are playing Sonic the Hedgehog on Trials Fusion. Someone has decided to make a map based around <laughs> based around Sonic the Hedgehog, and as you see, it is awesome. I'm I'm just bewildered how people are doing these maps now, and um, I've actually tried out quite a few. So I have quite a few lined up for this episode, and they are pretty, like really good. So I want to show you guys, but yeah, this one's Sonic the Hedgehog, and um, once again, someone's changed the bike model to you know something completely different. We're actually playing Sonic in this one, and that just bewilders me. Like I said earlier, how people do these—it's just amazing. But just look at the legs; really cool. And um, yeah, that was Sonic the Hedgehog. Ever wanted to be a toy? Well, now you can. As we play a map called Beware of the Dog. And this does remind me a lot of the film Toy Story. And if you do like the film Toy Story or like anything based around toys, this is the map for you. As we bounce off a green ball twice. And the tank's firing. Look at that, guys. That is amazing. And now we're entering like a Lego world, which is nice. We do like Lego. I think I crashed, didn't I? Ah, well, we'll carry on. Hopefully I don't crash this time. But yeah, this map is just genius. Um, I'm pretty sure, like, a few people did this on Shroud's Evolution. So it's nice to see that someone sort of made a comeback, or made it sort of come back in Trials Fusion. But this is really clever, like, um, we're just, like, on the pool table now. We're entering, I believe, soon. We're entering the kitchen, which is just up here. Yes, we are. We're entering the dining room, I guess. Yeah, the dining room. We're on the table, running over some butter. There's the ketchup. I do like ketchup. Ketchup's nice, but not as much. Not as nice as barbecue sauce, though, because barbecue sauce, well, that's the don of all sauces, in my opinion. But you know, you got the people who like the mayonnaise, people who like the mustard. It's your personal preference, really. But yes, barbecue sauce is my pick. But yeah, back to the map. We are now in a little paddling pool. And this is where the phrase, beware of the dog, comes into effect. Because you do need to be aware of the dog as he undevours himself on your face. Uh, very nice. Guys, I'm playing a map now called Super Mario Bros. And... You may remember me actually playing Super Mario World, so yes, this is another sort of map related to that theme. I'm guessing there's going to be quite a lot of maps coming out based around um, other video games. I do remember on Far Cry 3, quite a few people made maps based around other games and other themes in the media, I guess, which is cool. I think that is... It's good that um, creators do that, or map creators do that. But yeah, that was quite a short one actually. Did that in 34 seconds. But yeah, that was Super Mario World, I just wanted to show you that. Or Super Mario Bros, sorry. But yeah, I'm going to give it a like. We're playing a Trials version of a racing game. A car racing game, that is. And it's pretty cool, the handling's quite stiff. But I guess that's just part of it, part of the challenge. I don't want to go too fast. I know it says set a time, but I do know if you hit into the side of the barriers, you get stuck there, which is an awful shame. So I don't want to go too fast. Apparently, the bridge is coming up. I think that was the oh, there was a siren coming after us. I'm not sure. It's like a police car chasing us all of a sudden. Sorry before I heard. Yeah, there's the ring again. Oh, it is the bridge, I think. But I think we're nearing to the end. Even though I did see that on another track and it was nowhere near the end. So, I don't want to jump to conclusions. But yeah, this is really cool how the creators once again made a custom map with a different vehicle in it so it's not always a bike and like I said the car does get stuck to the side of the barriers but I guess that's your own fault for crashing into them so you have to have good control of the car if you accelerate too much you're about to crash but yeah that was 
for it. I was race car, race car five to be exact. And I enjoyed that, that was a hard skill game. Well I did. Guys, we're playing the Lost World and before we go forward, I'm gonna go back to show you that. Me suffering a fatal demise, a fatal bloody demise. And you know, I like creators, community creators, online creators who do that, have their own gist to their maps. Okay. Oh, we got control, we got control. Yes, we do. And um, yeah, I thought I'd show you that because that was awesome. I thought I was going to go off the back of that then. I wasn't thinking I was going to pick up enough speed, but we managed to make that. Okay, where are we going now? The world has broken for us to enter. And this is the lost world, I guess, guys. That uh, explains the track name. That's a bit annoying. And so is that. Me losing balance of my own bike, the Viper. Oh no, I'm supposed to tilt my body weight further back, come on. That's better. And we can make it, yes. Yeah, so I used the Viper for this track. I'm not sure, guys. Um, leave a comment down below which one you prefer, the Roach or the Viper, because I use both of them. And recently, I don't know, I've just sort of grown on the Roach. I guess you just need to master the control of the Viper, then you can sort of use it to its full potential. I remember using the Viper though quite a lot in the hard map, so... Oh, well that's annoying, I didn't even see where I felt it there. Uh, but that's what I mean with the Viper, you, you can just sort of screw up so easily by hitting the acceleration just too hard. And someone was telling me that I was going too fast, but hey, we made it, finally. Oh, look at that, there's like a statue there. And that was called The Lost World. Yeah, I'll give that one a like.